Good evening, Nigeria. Welcome to the Football Genius TV show. This is a program where you get to win loads and loads of cash prizes just by knowing about football, a beautiful game. It's a question and answer session. We ask you questions, you answer, and you win loads and loads of prizes. We've got our players here, we've got our substitutes, fantastic studio audience, and you, the fan at home. We kick off after the break. I feel so weak. I have so much work. Stress and go slow on the road. Madam, hope you are well. I feel so weak. Not you too. King Tonic will make you feel your best all day long and promotes fast recovery from illness. It's thick, rich, and tastes great, giving you strength and vitality. King Tonic is fortified with essential vitamins and minerals. King Tonic keeps you healthy and active. Also available in capsules, manufactured by SKG Pharma Limited. Okay, you're welcome back to the Football Genius TV show. The rules of the game are really simple. Two teams of two, one player, and one substitute teams A and B on either side of me. And then each player has three strikes and you're out. What does that mean? It means if you miss three questions, you're out. Round by round, you win money. Progressively, you win more money till it gets to the point where you stand a chance of winning a total of 15 million naira for the two sides. 7.5, 7.5. So, fantastic amount of money at stake here. So, let me introduce our contestants for today. Team A, Oladimeji Abolade is the player. Oladimeji is an engineer and he supports Arsenal. Um, it's not been a very good season for Arsenal, has it been? Obviously, it's not be it has not been, but we can't actually write them off because we are still in the semi finals of the FA Cup. Mm. And uh, we're still much in contention for the Premier League. Okay. Well, hopefully, that trophyless drought will end this season. I'm we, praying for you. Yeah, we're keeping faith <laughs> with, with the coach. All right. Um, his substitute player is Obina. Okay, okay. Obina is a Manchester United fan. Don't even let me talk to you. <laughs> <laughs> it's been a terrible season for Manchester United. Team B, Kende Omomumi, Oluwabumi. Kende is a photographer. And that's what you do for a living. And you're a Chelsea fan. Okay. Don't let me talk about Chelsea as well. Um, you are going great guns, but who knows? Some results lately have not gone your way, so all the best. And Team B substitute is Obiajulo Keke, who is an accountant, and he supports Arsenal. <laughs> all these people are in trouble this season. <laughs> all right, here we go. We start with round one of this competition, and in round one, you guys progressively win our prizes. I'll tell you the prize you will win, the amount of money you will win as we go along. We have somebody who is tabulating your prizes. At the end of this show, you go home with your money. Is that okay with us? Yeah, okay. Is that okay? Please, um, audience, when they get a question right, encourage them by giving them um, a small, not a big, a small round of applause. Okay, let me start with, um, let me start with uh, Mr. Abolade, Abolade, Major Abolade, right? Yeah. Aha. Your first question is a 2,500 Naira question. Gentlemen and lady, you have one minute to answer the question. You don't have to rush. I'm going to give you multiple choices and you can pick from there. For 2,500 Naira, the first Nigerian coach to win the African Cup of Nations for Nigeria. The options are A. Chief Aidebo Yonigende, B. Amadou Shwaibu, C. Sebastian Broderick, D. Stephen Keshi. Stephen Keshi. Stephen Keshi is correct. All right, we we'll go over to Kende. Kende, your first question for 2,500. The name of the Frenchman who currently coaches Arsenal. That's an easy question. Isn't it? Is A. Arsenio Wenger, B. Arsenio Wenger, C. Asena Venga, D. Asen Venga. Asen Venga is correct. All right, don't forget, if you miss one question, you get a caution. You miss a second, you get a yellow. You miss a third, you get a red card. But you can walk. You can take a walk if you don't want to get eliminated. So at some point, if you feel, I don't want to get a red card, you can say, hey, coach, 
I'm out. Okay? All right. Second question for Ola Dimeji. This is for 7,500 naira. The four time African Footballer of the Year winner now plays in Chelsea. Who is he? A. Mikelobi. B. Yaya Toure. C. Michael Essien. D. Samuel Etofield. Samuel Etofield. Samuel Etofield is correct. This is a tricky question for you, Amon. You have to be very careful here. Yeah? For 7 5. One of these players is not like the others in Nigeria's footballing history. One of these players is not like the others in Nigeria's footballing history. A. Victor Ekpeba. B. Rashidi Yakini. C. Kanu Anko. D. Austin JJ Okocha. Can please? One of those players is not like the others in Nigerian footballing history. There is an odd man out here. A. Victor Ekpeba. B. Rashidi Yekini. C. Kanu Wankwo. D. Austin JJ Okocha. JJ Okocha. Why? Mm. Well, JJ is correct, but let me help you. Um, he's the only one of these four that has not been named African Footballer of the Year. All the others have been African Footballers of the Year before now. Okay? All right. Um, we go back to Dimitri Abolari. This for 7 5. I'm going to try to coach one of these clubs to win the African uh, Cup Winners Cup. A. This is Lions. B. Enugu Rangers, C. Leventis United, D. Warriors. In business alliance on Boko. That's correct. <laughs> All right, three three questions in this zone before we move on to the next zone. Come on with me. The first coach to take the Super Eagles to the World Cup. A. Sabino Barinaga. B. Bora Milutinovic. C. Clemens Westerhoff. D. Lars Lagerbach. Western Hall. Correct. <laughs> All right. Um, Aladdin Meji. These players come from the same African country except one. DJ Drogba, Salomon Kalu, Yaya Toure, or all of the above. These all of the above. Do they all come from the same country? Yes, they do. All right, that's correct. All right, moving out of this zone now. Next up, Amaomi, in USA 94, Nigeria led Italy 1 0 at halftime. Who scored the Super Eagles goal? A. Rashidi Yakini. B. Emmanuel Amuniki. C. Daniel Amokachi. D. Moses Bako. Daniel Makachi. Daniel is wrong. You have a caution. The scorer of the goal was Emmanuel Amoniti. Mm -hmm. mm. All right, as we leave this zone, um, the only football miracle that was performed in Daman, Saudi Arabia is by A, Brazil, B, Germany, C, Italy, D, Nigeria. D, Nigeria. All right, that's correct. <laughs> All right, now. That's round one. We have some of these guys winning prizes. She has a caution. Two more and you are eliminated. So you've got to be careful when we move to the next round. We'll return after the break. Welcome back to the show. On the treasure seat, I have to mention that. On the treasures, we have Oladimir Jabolade, who's won 20,000 naira so far. Give him a big round for that. And Ken Diomomi, who is on 10,000 naira and is also on a caution. So she's got two more misses and she's out. We go to, we move from the preliminary zone and we go to the next stage, which gives you much more money. The questions here was 25,000 naira. Let's start with Oladimiji. 
the oldest club playing in the English Premier League right now is A. Manchester United B. Arsenal C. Stoke City D. Manchester City Stoke City Stoke City is correct Come on me how many presidents have FIFA had since it was founded? How many presidents? A, five, B, six, C, 10, D, eight. Six. Six is wrong. So Omaomi is now on a yellow card. Um, when you get to the next stage and you don't want a red card, you might just gallantly step aside and let your substitute step in. Okay? That's an advice. But I do hope you'll be able to get that. A big round for Abalade, who's going great guns. But the questions get, the questions get much more difficult, so to speak. Your next question. This referee handled the match where Maradona had what you call the hand of God. The name of the referee. A. Joel Cano. B. Ali Benasso. C. Kurt Cheshire. D. Abraham Klein. You have a minute? Actually, I don't have an answer to that, but I would go for Ali Benasso for B option. Ali Benoso is correct, and you say you didn't have an answer to that. Mm -hmm. That's why I don't say the 5,000 match. Omo Omi, you're on the yellow. Yes. You know that. Yes. So, another miss, you're out. Okay? You have won 10,000 naira so far. Okay? Now, in his 20 years football career, he played 900, 900 games for his club. Who is this? A. Pelé. B. Paolo Maldini. C. Lothar Mathias. D. Eusebio da Silva Ferreira. Remember, you're on the yellow. You want me to you repeat the options? In his 20 years football career, this player played 20 for 20 years. And he played 900 games for just one club. A. Pelé. You know Pelé. B. Paulo Maldini. C. Lothar Mathias. D. Isidro da Silva. These were players who played for a long time for one club. But one of them played for 20 years and played 900 games. Maradona. Maradona is not one of the options. Oh, Pelé. I said A. Pelé. 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 Well, I'm sorry, Pelé is wrong. Oh. The correct answer is Paolo no, Maldini. Sure. So a big round of applause for Amomi, who's won for herself 10,000 naira total. Thank you. So we'll take a break while Amomi steps aside and her substitute get, gets to get on the treasure seat. We're back with the Football Genius TV show right after this. Oh yes, with Coffex Cough Syrup, there's no way for cough. Take Coffex for effective relief of coughs in adults, children and infants above 3 months. Coffex is made by SKG Pharma Limited and available in pharmacies nationwide. Cough, 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 cough. You're welcome back to the Football Genius TV show. On the treasure seat, two participants, Oladimir Jabolade, who deserves a round of applause. He's showing great football knowledge. And making his entrance onto the treasure seat is Obiajulu KK, who's coming as a substitute after the main player, Kendi Omomi, was eliminated, having missed three questions. So we continue with Oladimeji Abolade. And like I told you, the questions get tougher as we climb up the money ladder so to speak the correct measurement of a standard football goalposts are 
The correct measurement of a standard football goalpost are A. 8 feet high, 32 feet wide B. 10 feet high, 30 feet wide C. 32 feet high, 12 feet high, sorry, 28 feet wide and D. 6 feet high, 32 feet wide You want me to give you the options again? Yeah. A. 8 feet high, 32 feet wide B. 10 feet high, 30 feet wide C. 12 feet high, 28 feet wide D. 6 feet high, 32 feet wide wide I go for A A is 8 feet high 32 feet wide that is correct <laughs> now it's time for Obia Julio KK to have his first question on the treasure seat and this is for the preliminary round of 2,500 now the first player in the world to lift the FIFA under 72 World Cup is from A South America B, Europe, C, Africa, D, Asia. Africa. Africa is correct. <coughs> now back with um, Oladi Major Aboladi. Did you study physical and health education? No. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right, you seem to have a full grasp of um, questions. All right, now, the most capped Brazil player ever the most capped brazil player ever is a marcos evangelista b otto antoine's combra c Edson Arantes do nascimento and d francisco manuel dos santos the options again a marcos evangelista b otto antoine's coimbra c Edson Arantes do nascimento D. Francisco Manuel Dos Santos. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I, uh, I don't have an answer. Well, let me go for let me go for D. D. Francisco Manuel Dos Santos is wrong. So you are on a caution, okay? But give him a round of applause. He's done tremendously well. Back with. Obia Julu or KK is a very, um, they are still in the preliminary stages, so your questions are not the so difficult to answer. Relax. Yeah. <laughs> you, you look tensed up. Relax. We're just having fun here. Mm -hmm. And, um, all right. This nation's, this goalkeeper did not consider a field goal to win the African Cup of Nations. He didn't consider a goal at all. And his country won the African Cup of Nations. A. Thomas Nkono. B. Alan Guema, Thomas Nkono of Cameroon. B. Alan Guemano of Cote d'Ivoire. C. Peter Rafael of Nigeria. D. Aziz Budebala of Morocco. A. Thomas Nkono. B. Alan Guemane. C. Peter Rafael. D. Aziz Budebala. A. Thomas Nkono. Thomas Nkono is wrong. Their correct answer is Alan Guemane. That means, of Cote d'Ivoire, that means you are on a caution. You're on a caution as well. Your next question. This referee has the honor to officiate the first ever World Cup match. The first ever World Cup match. A. George Rida from England. B. Ahmed Rego from Brazil. C. John Lenganus from Belgium. D. Domingo Lombardi from Uruguay. The first ever World Cup match. You want to go on the yellow? And uh, we go from the guy from Belgium, C. C. Jean Langer's Belgium is wrong. So you are now on a yellow. Okay? All right, back to Obia Juno KK. If the referee awards the penalty, are you listening? Yeah. The referee awards the penalty, yeah. and the player passes the ball to another player who scores. A, is it a goal? B, is it a yellow card to the player? C, is it not a goal? D, is it a red card to the player? 
penalty. Instead of taking it directly, I pass it. Is it a goal? Is it a yellow card? Is it a red card? Is it not a goal? It's a goal. It's sorry? It's a goal. It's, well, I'm sorry, it's not a goal. Because you're supposed to kick the ball straight at the goal. It's not a free kick, it's a penalty. So you're stuck on 2,500. <laughs> well, give him a round. It's not easy to come on the treasure set. Now, there's something we call a penalty question. And that's where we're at with you. Do you want to go with what you've won right now? Because if you go ahead and I ask you the penalty question, if you miss it, your winnings are half. But if you get it right, my brother, you double your winnings as we round up today. So, you have a choice. You want to go for the penalty question, and then the penalty question, I must tell you, does not have any multiple choice. So you know the implications. What if... Can I get to hear the question? No, I'll, I'll okay. give you the question. Okay, okay. I'll, of course, I'll ask you a question. Okay. But you have to decide before. Do you want to take the risk? Because once I ask a question, you can't say no, I'm backing out. Do you want to go ahead? If you get the question right, you double your winnings. If you miss the question, whatever you have won will be halved. Therein lies the danger. Huh? You want to take the risk? Or you want to can give I, it a... Can I get to know what I have already? Yeah, okay. You're on 80,000 now. If I ask you the next question, and you get it correctly, you go to 160. If you miss it, you drop to 40. And we've run out of time, so this is actually where we'll end today's show. So, what do you go for? What's your decision? You want to walk away with 80,000 and say, hey, thank you, presenter. Or you want to take the risk and win 160,000 naira? Let me walk away with the 80,000 naira. <laughs> okay. <laughs> On that note, okay, but let me, let me, I'll go ahead and ask you the question. Okay. And you answer it. So maybe if you had taken the risk, you might have gotten to win the I'm um, gotten to win uh, to double your money to qualify for the first ever World Cup which country did Egypt defeat um, you don't know lucky guy <laughs> the correct answer was Palestine so you would have won congratulations you won for yourself 80,000 Naira I feel so weak I have so much work Stress and go slow on the road. Madam, hope you are well. I feel so weak. Not you too. King Tonic will make you feel your best all day long and promote fast recovery from illness. It's thick, rich and tastes great. Giving you strength and vitality. King Tonic is fortified with essential vitamins and minerals. King Tonic keeps you healthy and active. Also available in capsules. Manufactured by SKG Pharma Limited. This is where we end it today on the maiden edition of the Football Genius TV show. We have our winners and we also have our sponsors here to present the checks. Victoria Cole is the Technical Promotions Manager, SKG. She will present checks to two of our winners, Obiajulu Okeke, who's won for himself the princely sum of 2,500 Naira. A big round of applause for Obiajulu Okeke. And Kendi Omomumi, who's won 10,000 Naira for herself. And our big winner for today, the man standing beside me, Oladime Jabolade. He's won 80,000 Naira. Mrs. Bosse Kile is the trade brand manager at SKG. She will present him with his prize.
All right, congratulations to all the winners. We want to thank you for joining us on the main edition of the Football Juniors TV show. We'd like to thank our sponsors, SKG Pharma, for their support. We ask you to join them. We want our youth to be empowered. Let them channel that passion for football into something positive. They come on the Football Juniors TV show and they can go away like these ones with some decent money. My name is Dave Jomotoimbo. Thanks for joining us on this show. We'll do it again next week. Good night.